So good morning. Today I am going to be dyeing my hair. As you can see, I am a wreck. Like, look at my hair. I just took my hair out of the braids. I had in for about two months. I got my hair done in November. We are in the new year. It's now January. And I just wanted to come on here and show you guys the process that I'm doing with my hair. So today I'm going to be dyeing my hair black and I want to do the journey with you guys. And I'm also getting a wash and set. But I was like, let me dye my own hair because I know how, how to do that. I don't need it professionally done. I'm using L'Oreal because honestly I didn't know what to use and they have so many different products and I'm just like why is there so many options I'm taking all the products out of here out of the box and I heard L'Oreal is really good um, I was also gonna get another brand I forgot the brand but that's that don't matter right now because we're using L'Oreal so in the box you get a developer this is how the developer looks it also come with the conditioning treatment and the pre-coloring treatment. I do have a rinse, you guys. So I'm thinking like, should I do the rinse on my natural hair? Because that's probably more safe than the dye. But then that means I will have to keep rinsing my hair. Or should I just dye it black and save the rinse for my bundles when I do my tracks? It's like such an impulsive decision right now because it's like last minute. It's just like something that I want to do for no apparent reason because my hair is dark already. But I feel like I look good in black hair, so that's why I want to do it. So, um, what would you do? Comment down below. What would you do? Would you dye your hair or rinse your hair? So, we're going to put on our gloves and then we're going to start working with the treatment y'all my robe has holes i had this robe for over 10 years so please okay all right so we need a mirror so i got my mirror i'm gonna use this and just part out my hair into four sections oh my god i need to comb out my hair i feel like my hair is super fragile Last time I got my hair um, washed by the Dominicans, they gave me a bald spot in the middle of my head. Um, I don't know if it's because my hair was super fragile. I know it's because I was stressed the hell out. So the stress caused me to um, have thinning over here. I was super stressed, I was very emotional, if you want to say suicidal, you can, um, but I would never get like that ever again, I promise to God, like I would never, not for no person, I don't really care if you live or not, <laughs> you know, so <clears throat> I got super crazy on myself, beating myself up every day for this person, so I told myself I would never again. And that's when I started doing more self-love and just started being more selfish and only helping my family more instead of friends. Yeah, so I look crazy. Right after this, I'm going right to the Dominican hair salon. Like, hi, can you wash my hair, please, and blow it out? <laughs> so if you want to save your coins, because I know to dye your hair at a salon is probably like $100. When I just bought this bottle for like 12 and I can apply it myself. I'm gonna take this. Why do I always smell everything? That's dangerous. And I'm gonna apply that on my ends. Just a little bit on the ends because my ends are super thin. As y'all can see. Look at this all this dead hair from me having braids in for almost three months oh <gasps> my glove ripped already like what is the point of giving you gloves if it's just gonna rip now i gotta go get some new gloves because i'm not i repeat i'm not i refuse to get black hands and i have white nails like no man 
The next step, you're gonna take this bottle and you're gonna pour it into here. Okay, so you gotta take this little top off and then you twist down and it'll break the, the seal because that's what makes sense, right? I just didn't want it to burst. Yep, that's what made sense. And then you're gonna twist this open. You wanna pour this in there. Y'all, when you have black hair, you a bad bitch, okay? Look at Kim K. She don't ever show y'all she dyeing her hair, but best believe her hair is always jet black. And Kara Monique hair is always jet black. Like, I know she be dying that shit. Y'all, I just woke up and I was like, I'm dying my hair. I already have. I bought these products months ago, like probably like six months ago. So you're gonna shake that, they said. Y'all saw how I skimmed through those um, instructions and I'm just doing it like I know what I'm doing. <laughs> So shake, 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 shake. So you guys, um, I went and got some black gloves and it looks so aesthetically pleasing. Like, I have a box of black gloves. I don't know why I didn't just grab that to begin with. Anyway, so we're gonna twist this top off. It did say work from the roots and then down. I told my mom I was dyeing my hair. She said, what? That's for older people, you're not old. Your hair's already black. The girls that get it, get it. The girls that don't, don't, okay? She took my son. Your hair, with dyeing your hair is for old people. It's not for the young. <laughs> Are you crazy? Like, do you know how many young people is dyeing their hair? I had to just tell her, like, I always dye my hair. I just stopped. But I used to always dye my hair in black. And I'm gonna start keeping up with that. It smells so strong, you guys. You gotta move quick because this thing's burning my eyes. Oh, I am crazy. You're supposed to twist this comb piece onto the top. Make it make sense, okay? So the key is to not squeeze the bottle when you put this tip on. You just let applicator inside just come out easily and you just comb it through your hair. You can squeeze a little bit if you feel like nothing is coming out, but that's what I'm doing and it's making the process so much easier, you guys. Y'all, I can't wait till y'all see the um, ending process. All this hair that's coming out is just dead hair. <laughs> I can't wait till you guys see the end of the process. My hair is really curly. Oh my god, I haven't seen my natural hair in so long. I haven't seen my natural hair in so long. You would think that I perm my hair to get this type of pattern. I don't. I never knew my hair was actually this curly. So I'm like the only one in my family that has this type of hair. Everyone here is more on the, um, I think it's 4C. I don't know what type of hair this is. But it's super curly and like... Thin and just like I don't know how to explain it, but you know like oh my ears are turning black. Uh-uh. But you know like I don't want to say I don't want to say the wrong things, but uh, just take a look for yourself. Like I can literally walk out the house with my hair like this, and it will stay like this. Like and people will be asking me am I Spanish because of my hair, but I'm Haitian and I'm the only one in my family with this type of hair. I need to wear my hair curly and down more often. I wear so much wigs, no one ever see my real hair really, but you guys. <laughs> and when I say no one, I mean like my family or 
my workplace. I'm always in wigs. My mom saw my hair just now. She's like, that's your hair? I'm like, yeah. People be thinking I put perm or whatever. I used to put perm back in the days, but I stopped that and I cut off all my hair just so my real hair can grow out and I wanna see how my real hair looks and this is how it looks. I don't know, like this is how it looks. Like. It's me combing out my hair with this little comb. I ain't gonna lie, I got some of it all over myself. Here, there's a few splashes on my chest. It's on my ears. This side is super bad. My whole ear is turning black, but I don't know how long you're supposed to keep this in for. But I have a lot left. So I'm just gonna squeeze it in there because I don't think, I think you have to discard it after you've opened the bottle. I'm gonna dye my wig with the rest of that because my wig needs some TLC. It needs to be black anyways. And this one bottle, you guys, one bottle will get you a long, long way, okay? I still have like 25% left and I've been squeezing a lot onto my hair. There's still a good amount left. My hair is very fragile, so I'm going to leave it in for 15 to 20 minutes, and I'm going to rinse it out. When it's time for me to rinse it out, I'm only going to use the conditioner treatment that it came with. I'm not going to use any shampoo, because honestly, the way my hair grows is because I only use conditioner. <laughs> Losing time, I'm fading fast I just wanna make it last Try to let go of the past I close my eyes, embrace the blast Sleepless nights and headaches stack Restlessness to hell and back What's my purpose, what do I grab? A slippery surface, a heart attack And sometimes you just gotta believe There's something that'll give you relief There's something that'll have what you need what you need Whoop. guys so my hair is washed out it's really dark i haven't even combed it out this entire time i don't know why but if i could run my fingers through it then it's somewhat um detangled now what i'm about to do is let it air dry and i'm going to the hair salon so that they can wash it treat it So you guys, I'm here. I got on my mask, but I'm here. I gotta take this out because they looking at me like, you know, they just looking at me weird. I haven't been to a hair salon in so long. She's probably gonna price me and judge me from my hair texture. But I know once she touches, she's gonna see that it's not that bad. It's kind of damp still, y'all, but I'm here. I'm trying to put up my camera somewhere. I don't know if she want to be recorded. So if I don't record, it's because I wasn't comfortable and that I just, I'm going to just see y'all later, <laughs> pretty much, when my hair is done.
So you guys, I don't know if you can hear me, but I'm doing the deep condition right now. She just washed my hair, but she did not comb it out. So I'm just like, <laughs> I hope it's not naughty. You guys, I was so confused on why sis is brushing my eyebrows for so long. Cut it. She did a very good job. I love it. I love her. Oh my god. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yes. Yeah, Thank you.